That looks lovely. This is going to be a really bumpy one. I don't know if I like having my life and my ways scrutinized. When I originally started this, it it wasn't for the reasons a lot of people think. And it seems to get like a resentment when you start to get a lot of subscribers. People come out of the woodwork and they're, oh, she's trying to, you know, beg for money. I haven't asked for anything. In fact, I've refused a couple people who wanted to send me something. I don't feel right about a thing like that. I was raised in a different era and time. My parents didn't have 25 cents for milk. I remember my mother telling me that. She wouldn't go to the welfare office. That was looked down upon. I bet you this is really bouncy. Maybe you better listen and not watch. So this is a huge apartment complex that uh, Mike, Maggie, Dennis Jr. and my little Finn live in. It's really very small, but they don't have three bedrooms here. The rent is ridiculous for what they get. These are older than the hills. Look at them. They do fix stuff, but sometimes they just rig it back together. I guess that's all landlords, isn't it? Almost all landlords. I borrowed my daughter-in-law's shoes. But I would, my baby toes are swelling from my arthritis. I hate that. It hurts. You put your sneakers on, sneakers you've had forever, and they should be stretched out. And your little toe aches and burns like blazes. But Meloxicam is really changing my life. 7.5 milligrams at bedtime. The only scary part about it is that it can cause sudden kidney failure without any warning at all. There's a woman coming and I, I don't want to insult anybody by putting them on my camera. Let's go look at the ducks. I hope there's no dog poop in the grass. Ugh, I hope there's no ants in the grass. Oh, that's the thing about Florida, right? Fire ants. You know why they call them fire ants? Because when they burn, it feels like your damn legs are on fire. Or wherever they bite you. When I first came to Florida, Denny Jr. was like uh, two years old. And, uh, no, th yeah. And um, I went to my cousin's house and uh, she hadn't been spraying. And, oh, ow. Oh, good. That wasn't it. That's just my arthritis. And um, they crawled up all over him. He didn't know. He'd never heard of that sort of thing. And, oh, they bit the tar out of him. We had to hose him down. Okay, she's gone. I'll get back up on the sidewalk. I don't know why I'm doing this. The only incentive for it is that there's women out there like me. And they want somebody who's going through what they've been going through. They want to listen to someone. Some people are housebound, you know? Some people are older. There's reasons why, you know, we have to stay where we are and we can't get out and do the things maybe we'd like to do. I'm doing really good on this leg. I'm surprised. It feels like something's biting my leg. That's my, uh, that's my fibro, I think. Hey, do you see the alligator anywhere? Let's look. I don't see him. Sometimes it comes right up on the edge of the... It's a little dry here. See how the water's down? Yeah. I'd sit on a bench, but they don't look like they hold up very well. A lot of construction here today. 
another nice porch. We'll go for a walk together. Why the heck not? Oh, look. I don't know. It all looks so inviting. I just wanted to be outside today. So Maggie called me, right? I was getting ready to go through this big tub of paper, and it was the bad paper, not the good paper that I can sell, and I was going to make you come through it with me. Someone suggested that maybe people think I'm fake because I make so many videos. Well, I need somebody to talk to. Sometimes I talk to Maggie, but sometimes she's busy, like she's teaching Finn right now. She couldn't get to school because her car broke down and she needed the toolbox she left for putting my AC units in, you know? And so I grabbed an Uber and brought her the box. Now the car's okay and she'll be able to... Uh, She'll be able to take me home. Maybe I'll stay till uh, Michael goes to work. He can't drive Uber right now. They need new coils and uh, something. Oh, and the uh, uh, head gasket might be leaking, leaking into the coils, and that could have been. What, and he won't know until he takes it all apart. But that's an easy fix, and their mechanic is so reasonable. Found this guy in a warehouse garage. morning. How are ya? That was a stupid question. What the hell's the matter with me? Poor thing's on oxygen. Looks white as a ghost. How are ya? Not well. I should have said beautiful day, isn't it? Why do I scrutinize my own self? I'm a crazy person. Oh, look, they have one of those cute little canopies for the sun. Oh my goodness. Wouldn't you love to just sit there and have a lemonade with whoever lives here? <laughs> That's silly, isn't it? <laughs> hey, got any lemonade? Oh, whoops, that door was open. Oh, gracious. Crazy woman on the loose. So the kids are going to give this up in May, and here's the problem. Dennis Jr.'s good friend wants to sell Dennis his house for a good price. And Dennis will not get his arse over to a bank and get the loan. And now we're hearing that the interest rates are going to go up in uh, April or May. And I, I'm going to badger the hell out of him because they've got to have a permanent place to go. They've been bouncing around too much. They've been here, I think, over two years. They did a seven month on their third year because they wanted a house, but then the price of everything went up. Am I being a Glenda and complaining? Too bad. I wonder how long I've been doing this. I need to find shade because I can't see anything. Amazon Prime, dun dun dun. They deliver everything, even stuff you don't order on Amazon. Okay, I'm in the shade, let me look at my phone. I've been blabbing for 10 minutes and 38 seconds. Okay, so um, maybe we can do another five. I guess sometimes when I'm really sad and it makes me feel like a hypocrite, I just say to myself, I should give this up. Just stop. Maybe delete the whole damn thing. I guess I don't like being scrutinized when people don't understand what's really going on. And am I making too many videos? I'd like your opinion. If you think I'm making too many videos and I'm getting really boring, please say something because I don't want to be that person. Where the hell am I? Oh God, I'm lost. I could go back the way I came, but... There's so much construction going on. There's a swimming pool here, and I don't have my swimwear. Oh. Okay, I'm complaining. Glenda. That's okay. I'll be a Glenda. Lordy, I've been a Glenda longer than that if it's just complaining. Remember my brother John saying, why do you complain so much? And my, brother, uh, my son Michael saying, um, what did he say? Mom, you're very negative. Yeah, I can be. I guess
guess I wanted a cushy life and I didn't get it. And that pisses me off. I worked hard. It's not like we didn't. Tried all kinds of stuff. Oh, my husband was so resistant at times, though. I wanted to buy property, and I knew what to buy, and I was right every time. We didn't buy it, and other people got rich. But that's Dennis. Or was Dennis. And now, you know, the truth of the matter is I never really wanted to be rich. That's the truth, because... <sighs> I don't want that to be the focus of my life is money. I want beauty, love, family. I want that to be the focus of my life. The truly wonderful, priceless things. Watching your grandson come into the world. Wow, you don't know what that was like. I, I, I can't even express it. That was something. Watching my kids, you know, change and adapt and evolve. My Bonnie now with a really good paying job. And oh my God, she gets her benefits right away. Right away. She doesn't have to wait for medical. She has to wait one month for 401k. I'm so excited for her, and it's remote. She can go anywhere she wants, and guess what? She's coming down here on March 30th. I hope she'll do a video with me. I'd love for you to meet her. She's the most lovely, petite, lithe little thing. I sent her to dance, you know. Six years of dance. So graceful. Tennis. Well... I guess I'll keep making videos because, well, who the heck else am I going to talk to? Might as well talk to you and you might as well hear me. And if you don't want to hear me, well, for Pete's sake, don't. Nothing matters to me. I don't care if I get one more new subscriber. I don't care. <sighs> Where am I going? Do I want to go there, or do I want to stay here? I think I'll stay here. It's closer to the water. Oh, those buzzing machines. Okay, shade. Let me see where I'm at. Shade. 15 minutes. That's long enough. I guess I just needed to vent. What was it I wanted you to comment on? Oh, if I'm making too many videos or they're too boring, tell me what you want to talk about, and I'll talk about it. I have a lot of stuff on my mind, but some things I'm afraid I might traumatize somebody if we get too serious. I don't want to do that to anybody. And now I'm going over 15 minutes. <sighs> I just needed to stop and see the day. See, this is why I want to live outside mostly. It feels so good. I can't tell you the, the breeze blowing, see the trees? I don't know if the air smells clean. I can't smell it. The sky is so incredibly blue. And the greens, so incredibly green. Oh, what is it about nature that's... So intoxicating. It just drags you right in. Look at it. Oh, mercy. I wish I had a little tent right here. I'd go inside, I'd sit down, and find that lemonade. I hope your day is as lovely and divine as this. Thanks for watching.